What is up, everyone? Andrew Buck Michael back with another round of your weather bucket questions. Thanks to everyone that's been asking the fall and winter questions on my Facebook page. And let's get to a few of them here. First question coming in from Robert. How is the wind chill calculated? Great question. There is an equation, and the colder it gets, the windier it gets, the more extreme the difference is between the temperature and the wind chill, what it would feel like to your exposed skin. Here's a chart as well. You can kind of see the difference based off of how cold it gets, how long it would take for frostbite to occur. Donna asking a question, how is the official snowfall measured? Is there an official airport ruler? No, any ruler will do. However, you need to make sure that you're measuring it on a clean, hard surface. So a lot of times they'll use about a 16 inch by 16 inch white square. So that way the black color doesn't absorb any extra energy from the sun for melting, but you measure it in there. You wanna take several readings, especially if the snow is blowing around. So that way you can get an average, but you need to measure it on a flat, cold surface. So that way there's no melting. Final question here from Michelle. Are we going to have a mild winter or a hard winter? We got to wait till the start of December to see where the jet stream sets up. However, right now, it looks like we will likely have a wetter winter than normal for us here across the area with temperatures near normal. So I expect us to have more snow this winter than what we've had for the past few because the past few winters, we haven't had much here in central Ohio. Thanks everyone for sending in your weather questions.